Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To access your personal OneDrive settings in Windows 11 when signed in using a Microsoft account, right-click the OneDrive icon that appears towards the right end of the taskbar. It is the icon that looks like a cloud. Then click the Settings command in the pop-up menu that appears to open the Microsoft OneDrive dialog box and display its Account tab. The Account tab shows your current OneDrive account and storage capacity in the OneDrive section. To choose which OneDrive folders to make available on this device, click the Choose Folders button in the Choose Folders section of the Account tab to open a Choose Folders window. Then check or uncheck the folders to make available or unavailable on this device as desired. When finished, click the OK button in the Choose Folders window to apply your changes. To choose how long to wait before locking the files in the Personal Vault in OneDrive, Select the desired duration from the drop-down in the Personal Vault section of the Microsoft OneDrive dialog box. To change OneDrive settings, click the Settings tab. Then check or uncheck the checkboxes in each section on the Settings tab to enable or disable each setting. The General Section settings are Start OneDrive automatically when I sign into Windows, Automatically Pause Sync when this device is in Battery Saver mode, and automatically pause sync when this device is on a metered network. The notification section settings determine which notifications you receive from OneDrive in the Notification Center. To only download files from OneDrive to your device as you use them to save space, check the Save Space and Download Files as You Use Them checkbox in the Files on Demand section. Alternatively, to download all files to your device from synced folders in OneDrive, uncheck this checkbox. To change backup settings for your device in OneDrive, click the Backup tab in the Microsoft OneDrive dialog box. To backup files in your Desktop, Documents, and Pictures folders, click the Manage Backup button in the Important PC Folder section to open a Manage Folder Backup window. Then click the icons for the folders to select or deselect the folders to back up. The storage space required then appears below the selection. To then start the backup, click the Start Backup button. Alternatively, to close the Manage Folder Backup window without making changes, click the X button in its upper right corner. To enable or disable automatically saving photos and videos to OneDrive and or screenshots to OneDrive, Check or uncheck the checkboxes in the Photos and Videos and Screenshots sections of the Backup tab, respectively. To change the network usage for OneDrive, click the Network tab and then select the desired Option button in the Upload Rate and Download Rate sections and enter any adjacent kilobytes per second of bandwidth to use if needed. To set Office App Collaboration in OneDrive, Click the Office tab. To enable or disable using OneDrive to sync Office files you open, check or uncheck the checkbox in the File Collaboration section. To choose how to resolve file syncing conflicts, select the Desired Option button in the Sync Conflicts section. After making any changes you want to apply to the OneDrive settings, click the OK button in the Microsoft OneDrive dialog box to apply them. To cancel any changes you made, Click the Cancel button instead. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.